Hello everyone, welcome back to the Hectic Homestead. Since the last episode, you can now see the basement is uh, fully dug. And now we have the footer poured. The footer was poured about an hour and a half ago. So in this episode, we're gonna talk about the footer. We're gonna talk about the former drain, drain tile that's around the footer and go over the specifics of the final, the specifications of the dig for the basement. So stick around, we'll get to it. I was out of town this morning working and had an early day to the, the weather and got a call that they were going to be pouring the footer today. So I drove three hours home, got there just as they started pouring concrete. So the former drain, drain tile is seen here it has two horizontally laid half inch pieces of rebar that's tied on these chairs. The chairs, you can barely see them here, you'll get a better look in a minute. The rebar gets tied to those and it's staked every couple feet to keep it from bowing out under the pressure of the concrete. So this former drain, drain tile, as you can see it has slits in it. That's so whenever the groundwater comes up, hits them slits, and ends up draining out of this pipe here. We'll eventually have this pipe ditched out down the hillside there. The former drain has slits on the outside and on the inside, underneath your, your basement slab. Here's where the pipe is. There's actually a pipe running in the concrete right here that connects the inner side here to the outer side. So that you're catching the water from the inside and outside, hopefully alleviating a lot of you know, moisture in the basement. This is a simple build. It's a 30 by 42 rectangle house. So it's pretty simple. They still have to pour a footer here and a footer there for the support posts, but they said they'll do that whenever, you know, they'll do them pours all in one whenever they do the slab for the basement. They'll be out in a couple days to finish up the block. So that pretty much wraps it up for this episode. I want to thank you guys for sticking around. If you enjoyed this video and you have not checked out the other videos, go check them out. If you want more, if you want to see more of the progress of the house, the blocking and everything, be sure to subscribe. Make sure you hit that like button on this video if you liked it. Of course, not asking for anything. You know, if you liked it, hit the like button. If you didn't like it, hit that dislike button. If you're neutral, hit that like button. Anyway, Make sure you subscribe if you want to stay tuned and uh, follow us on this house build and all the other projects here on the property. And be sure to hit that uh, bell icon. That way you're notified every time I upload a video. That way you can stay up to date as well and follow right along with us. Thank you and until next time, have a good one.